Hey there, Becky here from Inside the Square. In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can create sticky category links for a video collection page in your Squarespace website. Now, video collections are brand new to Squarespace at the time of recording this, and if you haven't set one up yet, head on over to insidethesquare.co forward slash video to check out my free training and to grab the guide that'll walk you through the setup step by super simple step. But if you already have one enabled and you wanna make those sticky category links that will stick to the top of the browser window when you scroll, this is the right tutorial for you. Let's hop into my demo site and I'll show you how this works. So here we are in my demo site and I actually have two different codes here. This first one is going to be for the category links that are a sidebar and the second one is for the category links displayed the way I have them right here. So I'm gonna hop into edit mode to show you really quickly in the video section, if you click on this icon right here, this is how you can actually change the format of the video page or video list style and scrolling down we have categories type. I have this listed as top, but you can also have sidebar. So we're gonna start with sidebar. We'll go ahead and save this. And then I'm gonna to navigate to design and then scroll all the way down to custom CSS at the bottom. So scrolling back up here, this code is for the sidebar and I do have it labeled in the description below. I'm gonna paste it right here and check it out. When we scroll down on this page, as soon as this sidebar hits the top of the browser window, it's going to stop so we can scroll through all the videos and still navigate through them. Let's go into full site preview here so you can see how this works. Again, it'll stop at the top of the browser window and I can scroll through all of the content. Pretty cool, right? But it goes by a different selector name than the top bar. So let's go ahead and remove this and we'll hop into edit mode and scrolling down here, let's go ahead and click this icon and we'll change this to categories type top. And now it's gonna move it to the top of my videos. Okay, let's go ahead and select save. And I'm gonna grab this additional code over here. Gonna copy this code, paste it into my custom CSS, and let's go to full website preview. When we scroll down, as soon as that hits the top of my browser window, it'll stop so I can scroll through the videos and still see all of these options. Alrighty, that's it for this tutorial. And again, those codes I just shared are listed in the description below. Just make sure you grab the right one for the sidebar versus the top bar category links. Thank you so much for watching. And to learn more about customizing Squarespace with code, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel because I post a new tutorial like this every single week. Thanks again for watching. And most importantly, have fun with your Squarespace website. Bye for now. If you liked this tutorial, you'll love my Squarespace CSS cheat sheet. I took all of my pro tips and custom codes specifically for Squarespace and put them into one gigantic PDF. Available now at insidethesquare.co forward slash CSS. That's insidethesquare.co forward slash CSS.